Hey, look at what the cat dragged. Oh my gosh. Look what the cat dragged in. Yes, I wanted to say cool word, but <laughs> this beginning not good. Okay, guys, I have, I have figured out with grammar tenses. Yes, a grammar tenses in the English language. Yes, no, grammar sentences with um, tenses is uh, timing. Timing is uh, sentences of uh, like present simple, future simple, past simple and other things. Yes, I did it and I have new words else. I want to use it every day and every morning and every moment. New word, new words. What I will use? I will use uh, words. I understand. I understand that for improve your vocabulary and for improving your uh, skills of English, for be more fluently, need to learn more words. Yes, to grammar, words, and other new constructions. And I started with "Look what the cat drag in." Yes, I started with this greeting, with this uh, hello analogy, and Elsa. I I uh, used used to figure out figured out this phrase phrase. Elsa, I realize realize yes realize understand i realize that for being cool in the english need to be cool in grammar too because if you have no good grammar you will be suck you will suck yes and what i realized is what i wrote for this we have 12th plus four extra bonus is <laughs> 16, 16 other tenses, yes? First is past simple, yeah? It looks like uh, when... Okay, we will use word go, yes? Because here, я ходил is Russian. Я ходил, it means I went. I went, I went to... I went to the shop yesterday, yes? I went to the shop yesterday. Cool, cool enough, good enough, yes. I went, I was in the shop, yes, yesterday. Elsa, I, я хожу, it means uh, I go. It's fact, it's fact, I go. Fact, I, I can go, yes. It's like I go, I go to the street every day. Yes, fact, good, super, nice amazing next future symbol is i will go i will go day after tomorrow is uh, fact i will go yes i will go yes it's normally because uh, i have good legs i have good eggs i have good uh, mushrooms uh, mustache without mustache mushrooms mushrooms some stuff of the <laughs> vegetables or what is mush mu mushrooms eh? Next, it was simple, yes, good, super. Next is continuous, yes, t -t 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 -t. past continuous. It what is is process. It's some of the direction, direction. What it mean when we have restrict, restrict, yes, restrict, uh, restrict limits of the process when we in the. Process right now. Restrict is put a limit on, keep under control. What I <laughs> wrote, maybe it's wrong. Okay, but past continuous. What is when we will use? What is? What is? Ah, what is it? Okay, what is it? Sorry, I want to practice grammar. Yes. Next is. Uh, <laughs> Why next? Past continuous, yes. We will use formos. Was or were, if you are plural and nice, you have many children. Yeah. And uh, children. Uh, children is plural of all child, yes. Understand it. Witty. Savvy. Yeah. 
What's were? What's were plus verb in third form? Ink. Ink ending of the word. It will be on the Russian. Я шел. It means that I was walk. I was going on the street yesterday. Yes, I was going. It means that it was process. And after this, suddenly something was jumping for your head. Yes, uh, and uh, okay, you understand what I mean. Next is uh, present. Present continuous. When right now we have process. Right now I'm talking with you. Yes, it's process. And for MSR plus v uh, verb three, it's you understand me. MSR plus v three, a verb in the third form is uh, I'm I'm going on the street right now. Yes, right now, right now, right here, right now. I put the apparel. Yes. Next, future continuous. I will be going. It means that I will be going. I understand that is plan. Plan. F it's not like a in the previous future. Fr future simple is when we use I will go. I will go day after tomorrow. Yes, y you understand that you will go because uh, you can go. Yes, it's fact. And uh, it's plan. Plan for the future. I will be going on the street from this timing to this timing. It will be interesting. Yes, good. I understand. I. It's my. It's my opinion. Maybe you are more cooler. Please, if you are wall wall man in the chat room, if you are grammar super genius, please write me in the comment section if you are maybe wrong. Okay, perfect. Per, 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 past perfect is. Uh, had plus v3 ed it means that we have some of the action in the past yes in the past we have action 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 was for example one girl was doing was doing exercises exercise for homework no was doing exercises yes exercises she she exercised she exercised at home yes but but before before was one more one more event it was like a I I went I I had I had gun I had gun to the home when she exercised. It was like a, in the moment when we have some of the t -t -t I'm went gone. Oh, no, no. I had gone to the home when she exercised. It means that she exercised, yes? And one more plus here. Good. Maybe I understand correctly. Maybe not. But okay. Meme review. Uh, next is present uh, perfect. Is present perfect have has plus v3 ed. It means that we have moment when I have result in the natural, in the present time, in time. I have a result. Fuck you, some of the moments uh, what was. No, nothing. Need only result. You're against in this moment. You are selfish and. Uh, Need only result, and that's all. It's about present perfect. It's when uh, I, I have, I have gone, I have gone. It means that fuck you for what the fuck was uh, in the previous time. No, 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 bullshit. But now I'm interested that I'm here, and that's all. It's result. I have gone in this place. Yes, I have gone in this place. That's all. Need a result. That's all. Nothing else. It's maybe... Okay, I have... Ah, uh, no. Okay, I have gone to the street. Fact that I'm... I've... I've located on the street. 
if I will do vlog, yes? I have located to the street. I, right now, in the location of the street. Yes, need a result only. Next is uh, future perfect. Future perfect is will have. We have something in the future and it will be finished. And it means that you have plan for it and need only result that yes, I will be in this timing and all will be correct. I will have gun at 7 p.m. tomorrow. It means that uh, you have plan for tomorrow and you are right now, right now you are walking, you are going and maybe before you walk into but it's ah no ah need only result okay result that you will be will be in the place it's a result perfect is a result result uh, yes for a moment i will have i will have uh, I will have cooked dinner for your visiting. For your visiting at 7 p.m. I will prepare my... I will have... I will have dinner. Yes, for the moment. And next, but not at least, at last, yes, is... Oh my gosh, some of the moody more mood perfect perfect continuous past perfect continuous it means had been very ink it means that uh, for the past in the past we have line yes here and here moments and you was here yes you was here and now here, in this line, is the line, I imagine it. And between is our process. And when I will say, I had been, I had been, I had been, I had been going, I had been going five kilometers before you ring me before you ring me ring 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 it's ring ring yeah before you ring me it means that in that moment you you was re, re, ringing me yes you was ringing me in this moment but before i'm going some of the numbers of kilometers yes i understand it and present perfect continuous what is it means that for for the present same situation but for the present it will be i have been i have been uh, going five kilometers it means that i was and now i'm going i'm continuing it means that right now i'm watching on my fitness bracelet and what is ah five kilometers good and i'm continuing okay it means and uh, for the perfect continuous is if we will continue our walking and on our fitness bracelet will be aha uh -huh, we'll have been 15 kilometers after two hours good after two hours i will have i will have uh, 15 kilometers good nice now i understand these timings now i understand how it works yes thanks so much for watching i hope you was joined joint uh, if you did uh, please tell me and else i want to practice more words is carry out to do a particular piece of work research i carry out i carry out my english grammar i uh, carry out my memorized work i carried i carried out my uh, my uh, memorized work for 10 hours yesterday bring to a conclusion is uh, something for end it yes ending it means that bring to a conclusion 
it's my practice list. Practice list I want to show you. Yes, this. Yes. Bring to a conclusion. It means that we, I, bring to a conclusion. We have, I bring to a conclusion my project. Yes. And I bring to a close my project, or I, I bring to a close my, I bring to a close my work time with the grammar. Fulfill, bring to com completion, completion, to completion, completion, completion or a reality, achieve or realize something desired, promised or predicted. Fulfill. I fulfill my gr English grammar. I fulfill this book. Okay? I fulfill this book. I ended reading. Finalized. I finalized this book. Yes. I finalized this book. Cool. And confine is uh, keep off arresting someone or something within certain limits or space. We have this limit and we have two points and we have confine it. And find these points. What does it mean? Can find these points. Ah oh, no 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 no. Yes. Can can find this. Uh, can find these points with that time. Yes, with this time. Okay, I hope you understand me. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. It. And uh, see you in the next time. I'm more stronger. And you will be stronger too. Need to practice, practice, practice our grammar. And our English language. I want to be successful in it. Successful in the learning. And successful in the English language. I want to speak with you. I want to speak like I'm native, yes? It will be really nice. Thanks so much for watching. See you in the next time. Bye-bye.